Hey y'all, welcome, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another video. As you can tell by the title, today I have another video to add to our Amazon Designer Dupe series. If you are new to my channel, with this series, I like to go on Amazon and pretty much just find luxury or high quality pieces that really look like they could make for some great designer dupes. And I come on my channel and I share them with you all. So if you're interested in seeing what I have today, definitely keep watching okay y'all so today's video will be the first of the month and at the first of the month i really like to just go on amazon browse through a hundred different products and figure out what am i most likely probably going to purchase this month so today that's what i'm going to be doing i went on there i found some handbags i found accessories i found some shoes that i'm more than likely going to purchase this month and share with you all so i decided to go ahead and let y'all see some of the finds i'll probably be purchasing I'm going to go ahead and break this video up into sections and I'm, and I'm going to go ahead and post the sections on the screen just in case you are here for like handbags and you want to go straight there or maybe you're here for the shoes and you want to go straight there or maybe you're here for it all so you're just going to watch the video all the way through. Either way, I want to make the viewing experience better for you so I will go ahead and have those timestamps posted on the screen. So let's just go ahead and jump into these finds. Okay, so we're going to start with handbags. If you know, last month I found so many different great designer dupes. I mean, the quality was just really good so I'm crossing my fingers that this month will be the same so let me go ahead and show you the first bag i'm really eyeing and i think will also make a great designer dupe now they are duping the brand bottega i feel like amazon has a lot of bottega dupes and the ones that i've purchased so far the dupes are actually really good the quality looks great so i'm excited for this one as well this is a dupe for like the bottega double knot bag except this one is like the gold metallic texture now let's talk about pricing i love to talk about the pricing on my channel so that we can see how much we're really saving so if you were to actually get this bag from Bottega if you were to get the actual Bottega mini knotted metallic bag it is about five thousand three hundred and fifty dollars if you go the Amazon dupe route you're gonna pay about forty seven ninety nine before taxes so you're looking at about fifty three fifty versus forty seven ninety nine that's obviously a steal now what I did notice on the actual Bottega bag I feel like it has silver mixed in the Amazon bag is just strictly a gold which again that's why I love dupes it's not going to be spot on it's just supposed to look you know kind of similar you're getting the look for less but y'all let me know what y'all think about this particular dupe let's go ahead and move on to bag number two now bag number two is also another Bottega dupe I actually have three Bottega dupes so I'll show you the next one after this one as well so this one is actually a different it's more of like a fun bag it's not really a bag to me but it is a dupe for the cassette belt bag so kind of like the bag you can wear around your waist or across this way I feel like this bag is not the most functional this is a bag that you wear if you're only going to be carrying like your card holder your phone lip gloss and keys you're not going to be able to load a lot of stuff in this bag but sometimes that's literally all you need maybe if you're going walk in or you're just going to be walking somewhere and you don't want to carry a big bag these type of bags are definitely practical for that but probably for the everyday you know need it might not be the most practical but i feel like you know that when you're purchasing a bag of this size so i definitely want to go ahead and get this bag I definitely want to get it in the Bottega green color. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Let's go ahead and move on to the next Bottega dupe. Okay, so next I have a dupe for the Bottega Small Andiamo. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. But at first, I wasn't really sure how I felt about this bag. I didn't know if it was like, if it fits to my personal style. But after I seen, you know, the bag worn in different ways, I was like, okay, I can definitely get into that bag. And I don't even have the dupe in person yet, nor do I have the actual Bottega bag in person. But just going off of simple pictures, the Amazon dupe literally looks like it is spot on to the actual Bottega bag. And I just think that that is so crazy. I mean, even the quality on the Amazon bag, just through pictures, looks like it's going to be really good. So I really feel like this is one that I'm actually going to be purchasing as well. Now, this particular Bottega bag actually retails for $4,200. The Amazon dupe is about $79.99. And to be honest, for what the quality appears to be just based off pictures, I feel like it is definitely worth $79.99. I'm not really 100% sure what color I will get in this bag. I may play it safe and get it black, or I might get another color, you know, more closer to like spring because in spring and summer is when I tend to wear more of my color. Um, so I don't know if I want to move into getting my bags for spring or if I want to get a neutral bag in this specific style. But y'all let me know because I will be honest, at first I wasn't really feeling this bag because like I said, I didn't know if it spoke to my personal style. 
but after looking at it and just seeing how similar or how it looks compared to the actual Bottega bag, it looks like a really great dupe and who doesn't want a really great dupe? Let's go ahead and move on to the next bag. Okay, so next up I have a dupe for the Hermes Mini Kelly. If you've watched any of my other Amazon dupe videos, Anytime I mention Hermes, I pretty much state that I probably will never purchase an Hermes bag just because I cannot see myself spending that much money on a purse. I I just don't think I could do it. I know a lot of people do it because they absolutely adore these bags. They love the brand. Uh, maybe they collect them. They're great for resale. I see the prices. They are definitely probably worth the investment. I just won't be making that investment with these bags. But if I do find a good dupe, I will share them because like I said, I just don't think it's my ministry to spend that much money on the bag. So let's talk about this dupe that I found on Amazon. So again, this is a dupe for the Mini Kelly. And it is just really cute. Now, as you see on the screen, I have it on here in this cognac color. That is the exact color that I'm gonna purchase. I fell in love with that color recently and i think it's going to be one of my staple colors for this spring but the overall bag it is a small bag it's not really a big bag and i'm fine with that i love a big bag here and there i love a medium sized bag here and there but i also really 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 love small bags i feel like you just need a mixture of all three so this is going to be one of the smaller bags just by looking at the bag, it does look like the Hermes Mini Kelly. Obviously, there's going to be some great discrepancies because the price alone is just not even comparable. So you're going to have discrepancies. But if we're just looking at looks, this definitely looks like a great dupe for that bag. Let's go ahead and talk about pricing because like I said, Hermes, the price it gets up there now obviously there's a system to being able to buy hermes bags you have to spend a certain amount of money before you're even eligible to buy certain bags so i again i probably will never purchase a bag so i don't really know too much about that this is not really the channel to explain that process because i haven't been through the process and i probably won't be going through the process if you know you know that you have to basically i think spend a certain amount before you can even purchase um particular bags or bags in general i'm not really sure again that is not my ministry but i do know that you can obviously get online and find them from like consignment shops secondhand resale shops things like that so i was able to find a mini kelly um from hermes at about like thirty five thousand one hundred and seventy five dollars so about thirty five thousand dollars yeah for this very very small bag but again i know people adore these bags and for some people that might make sense and more power to you but if you want to go ahead and save thousands on thousands on thousands of dollars you can go ahead and get the amazon dupe for about 54.99 so that's a huge price difference but if we're just going off looks i personally think it's going to be a great dupe y'all know what y'all think i am certain that this will be a bag that i get that i will be able to review and just show you guys so let me know in the comments your thoughts on this i ask all the time and majority of the time y'all in the comments are on the same page as me i don't think we're willing to spend thousands of thousands and thousands of dollars on the bag but i know there are some of you out there who actually would and again more power to you let's go ahead and move on to the final designer bag dupe okay so let's go ahead and move on to the final dupe as far as handbags are concerned now this dupe is actually a dupe for the prada crochet like tote bag i feel like this bag is going to be perfect for spring moving into summer especially for a good vacation i feel like this is the type of bag you need you can take with you to sit on the beach throw everything that you need take it with you on the beach so if you have a vacation planned up and you're looking for something that looks like luxury but you don't want to spend a lot of money to get it definitely check out this dupe i'm going to go ahead and put the actual prada crochet bag on the screen and i'm going to actually post the amazon bag on the screen as well so you can see they look very similar i think it'll be a really great dupe um i plan on going on vacation this summer so i'll definitely be uh, testing this bag for you all and letting you know my thoughts on the actual amazon one okay so the actual prada crochet tote bag retails for $2,100 and the bag on amazon retails for $25.99 so we have $2,100 versus $25.99. Again, you are saving thousands. So yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think about this particular dupe, and we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next section of today's video. Okay, so we have now made it to the shoe section of today's video. Now the first dupe I have for you is a dupe for the Saint Laurent sling bags. I told you all in a few videos that I have been loving sling bags. They are just so comfortable, so easy to put on. And I was recently scrolling on Instagram and I saw this post, I think it was an ad, and I saw these sling bags and I was like, those are so cute. They just look so classy. They just look so luxury. I have to have those. 
I honestly really, really, really love the actual Saint Laurent ones. And I've been considering like, should I actually get the actual ones? Because they just look so high quality. But then I'm also thinking, are my feet going to hurt? Like, is it going to be worth spending the money to endure the pain? They may be comfortable. I haven't did my research yet. I'll come back with y'all with that information when I can. But let's talk about the dupe from Amazon. I'm going to go ahead and post it on the screen. As you can see, the heel looks very, very similar. I'm going to test these out first. And if these are comfortable, I might just stick with these. I'm just going to be honest. I don't know. But the actual shoe is really, really nice. Um, so yeah, I'm going to post it on the screen. Let's go ahead and compare prices. We've talked about the looks. It honestly looks spot on. So let's talk about the pricing. Now, the actual St. Laurent Slingback retails for $1,090. The Amazon shoe retails for $57.99. So of course, there is a great difference in the prices. But for the look, you can definitely get it for less if you choose to go the Amazon dupe version. I think I'm going to test it out just because I'm so in love with the actual St. Laurent sling bag that I think I'm just going to test out the dupe to see my thoughts and if the shoe in person does not give me the same feels that the actual St. Laurent shoe is, I think I'm going to have to get it because these are just like classic shoes. You can really wear them with anything, slacks, jeans. So I feel like they would make sense to purchase. So y'all let me know in the comments. Let's go ahead and move on to dupe number two. Okay, so next up I have a dupe for another Bottega product. I have a dupe for the Bottega stretch strap sandals. And I really do like these shoes. They are very simple. I more specifically want a dupe for the Bottega green color. I feel like that green was deemed the Bottega green color and it's like people just never stopped calling it that me included I absolutely love that green I have it in purses I have it in shoes the shirts I just really love that color um so these are just very simple sandals I think they're gonna be so good for spring and summer okay so the actual Bottega shoe retails for about $990 the Amazon dupe retails for $46.98 so a win is a win and you're gonna see on the screen they look very 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 similar so let's go ahead and move on to dupe number three. Okay, so I have another heel for this next dupe. This is a dupe for the Jimmy Choo Blue Bling 100 heels. I just think that these will be really cute to have for this summer. I like the little diamond aspect of it, but more importantly, I like the denim. I can just see myself wearing these with a nice pair of like denim straight leg jeans, a cropped white shirt with maybe a cute little fun denim bag. I just think that would look really nice. So I definitely wanted to go ahead and try these out. I'm gonna go ahead and post the actual Jimmy Choo shoe on the screen as well as the Amazon dupe version and you will see Amazon pretty much nailed it again. They look very, very similar. I feel like it's gonna be a great dupe. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to definitely try this one out. So the actual Jimmy Choo shoe, I'm seeing it retail for about $637 while the Amazon version retails for $49.99. So obviously saving a ton of money for these shoes to look almost spot on. So as you know, a win is a win. Okay, so moving on to the final shoe dupe. This next dupe right here is a dupe for a Gucci product. This is a dupe for the casual Gucci slide with the horse bit. I'm going to go ahead and put it on the screen. And then I'm also going to put the Amazon dupe on the screen as well. Another dupe that I feel like is super, super close. Um, the actual Gucci shoe retails for $920. The Amazon shoe retails for $41.98. Like the Jimmy Choo dupe, I feel like this will be a great shoe to wear with jeans. Just super casual. You can also wear these with slacks. It's like not doing too much. It's elegant. It's classy. Just a really simple heel or sandal, I should say. I think this is also going to be perfect for the spring and summertime. Okay, moving on to the accessories portion of today's video. The first dupe I have to share are these right here. These are obviously from Amazon. I'll go ahead and pop them on the screen. These are a dupe for the actual Loewe. I believe these are the Paula's Ibiza square frame glasses. I actually really love that pink tint. This is another thing I think will be perfect for spring and summer. As you can see, the frames are not spot on. The Amazon ones are a bit more rounded, I believe. But nonetheless, the overall style is very similar. Now, the actual Loewe glasses retail for $380. The Amazon re glasses retail for about $16. So again, obviously you're saving a ton of money and, and the products look really similar. So let's go ahead and move on to the next dupe. Now the next dupe is a dupe for the Bottega drop pendant necklace. A few videos ago, I showed you the Amazon dupe for the Bottega drop earrings and they were really nice. I got the large size as well as the smaller size. So this is basically that same product just in a necklace form. So Amazon, of course, made a dupe for it. The actual Bottega drop pendant necklace retails for $820. 
the Amazon dupe retails for $12.99. This is a dupe that I feel like just makes sense. Why would I spend $820? When I can get something super similar for under $15, it just makes more sense to me. Um, the next up is another pair of sunglasses. These are a dupe for a pair of Prada sunglasses. I will put the uh, Prada sunglasses on the screen. The uh, Prada sunglasses retail for $520. The Amazon glasses retail for under $15 again. So a win is a win. I just feel like you're saving so much money. As you can see on the screen, they are very similar. Just a kind of cool shaped black pair of sunglasses. So now we're going to go ahead and move on to the uh, final products. I feel like I zoomed through the accessories and that's only because it's not really much I can say. I definitely can't wait to purchase some of these to actually see them in person. And then of course I can give you more thoughts on the actual product. So the uh, final product is just this luxury scarf. They have uh, several different variations. I feel like a really nice scarf can really just elevate simple outfits. And then there's also just so much you can do with the scarf. You can put it in your hair, you can wear it around your neck, you can tie it around your favorite bag. And I just feel like these particular scarves scream luxury. Um, not necessarily a dupe for any scarf in particular. I just feel like a luxury looking scarf is a great way to, like I said, elevated outfit or add to a purse to just give it an extra pop y'all let me know what y'all think do you wear scarves i personally don't but after seeing these right here i'm definitely interested in playing around with them so i think i'm going to be purchasing one and i'll definitely again share them with you all so yeah y'all let me know what y'all thought about today's finds as always i will have them linked below let me know in the comments which product do you think i should definitely try out First, make sure you come back next week. I will have some of these products and we will actually review them. I will show them to you all and give you my thoughts. If you enjoyed this video, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe for more and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.